It's just a typical morning for me. Running late. Good morning, sunshiners and possibly sunshaders. So the first day in a while where it's actually really warm in Florida and I no longer have any pairs of shorts and I am wearing pants. Okay, it may have been warm yesterday, but um, I didn't leave my apartment, so. So a few issues happened with my uh, script idea. It was too long, and so because I had to compress it to upload it to the online uh, server thing, it was corrupted, so they couldn't download it. Um, I start too early because there's a thing with uh, script writing where you um, have to start late and end early, but still kind of show what's going on. And I started like way too early, ended about on time for the script. So still early, but good that it's early, I guess. Uh, so I have a lot of work to do on my script, um, but unlike the people who went before me, he didn't exactly tear apart my script and uh, say it's, um, hard to understand. It's just too long. It needs to fit within uh, three to five pages to be considered a short story. If the file was corrupted, um, how did we see the actual script idea outline? Well, I had it on my computer. It was just uh, the professor could not open it on his. That is uh, the first issue. And it's because of the compressing, apparently something went wrong and that happens often actually in other classes we had to reopen a whole uh, assignment because like more than half the people had a corrupted file so yeah have to make things small enough to not need to compress them awkward cut so i got all excited that something i had ordered um had arrived. I go to my mailbox, there's something inside, and it's a box containing this, my charger. It was a major, major downer because I was expecting something else. It claims it arrived on eBay, so I'm gonna head back over to my uh, mailbox and see if there's anything else. There seems to be an issue almost every single time that I have a package shipped to my house, apartment, whatever. This time, I'm pretty sure it was shipped through UPS, so I'm going to the UPS store and seeing if they have it. Great, on Saturdays, they close at three. Great. So eBay's form of tracking the package if you give a tracking number says it was delivered. So does UPS.com when I typed it in on there. It says it was put on my front porch, which is a generic term for it was delivered to the location. If I had not been here when um, they delivered it to my front porch, either they would just leave it there or put a notice saying it was in the front office. There was no notice, it was not on my front porch, and it was not in the main office. So, uh, where is it? I don't, I don't know. Um, either it's at the UPS store, which is inconveniently closed on Sundays, or the person sending it accidentally put the wrong address. But if it does not arrive by Monday, because as previously stated, UPS is apparently closed on Sundays, or at least the store that might have it is. Uh, so if I don't get it on Monday, I'm going to have to contact eBay and uh, see if they'll give me a refund. Here's an interesting development. So, according to what the person at the help center for UPS said when they looked it up on their computer. It was delivered here yesterday at 
2.11 p.m. Um, yeah, so I was here all day yesterday and um, it didn't arrive or if it did I was not aware of it and so somebody could have taken it is now the cons consensus I can't speak um, so that is an issue but I don't remember anybody coming yesterday I was here so they would knock on the door so this is this is strange okay I'm actually going to call the uh, help center back even though it took almost five minutes for me to get off hold because uh, now there is something that's even more interesting and that is that they never came even though it says they did this whole not showing up at all like I got no knock or doorbell ring from the UPS guy so if he was here he was very quiet so uh, I'm gonna check again tomorrow like even if it has the wrong address on it if it says Ben stock I'm taking that package okay I'm not entirely sure if you can see me um, but uh, there's no school tomorrow. There's almost never school on Sundays But I still have homework and Tracking down that package, which I think I know where it is the person um, who looked in the closet of packages which um, Sounds inappropriate, but it's not um, Didn't really look at every single package in there. They moved around like one or two and said it wasn't in there but I think it still might be, so I'm going to check again if the main office is open. I don't know what their Sunday hours are. Anyways, good night, whosoever's watching this. See you tomorrow. Well, I won't see you, but you will see me. Why is it so echoey in my bedroom? Echo! Echo! There's a vlog on the web featuring Ben Stock that he shoots every day as he walks and talks. If you're Bigfoot in the woods or producers in LA, you should stop all your shit and watch Sunshine Shade. Sunshine Shade. Sunshine Shade. Has nothing to do with Florida, but it's great. If you can't wait, don't get irate. Just stay in your sheet, cause it's Sunshine Shade.